Hey everyone, Miss Janine here. Let's take a look at what is due. I finished grading for week two, and I would say about half the class did not complete all the assignments. So I want to make sure you understand where to find what's due and what to do. I know I, I'm pretty sure we went over it, but I'm going to do it again. All right, when you log in, go to the weeks tab. Now, also in your introductory documents, there is a tracking calendar that will list everything. So I recommend you print the tracking calendar. You just go in here and you'll see the tracking calendar. Go ahead and print that so you have it or save it to your computer so you have it to kind of use as a checklist. But anytime you, you feel like you're not understanding what's due, go to the weeks tab. And this is where you're going to find, okay, I'm going to pull up week two because that's what we were just on. Let me go back. I want to show you something. All right. So the weeks two, it showed, you know, what we're going to do this week. And it's even giving you a little bit about ONET. And I know I told, I shared ONET with a couple of you last week in your discussions. So you're just going to click. And then it's going to show your res your discussion post. It wants you to watch this slide. You're going to do this. Back, click on that and read that. And then this is your discussion question. But remember, you have all these activities. Initial resume, initial cover letter, theorist reflection. You had quite a few. You had five things in addition to the discussion post and engaging with your peers in the course room over three days. So if you did not do any of these, make sure you get them done and turned in because this week you're updating these two. These are hundreds if you do them and zeros if you don't. So please get them turned in. We're going to, you know, it's a lot of work. I admit I've seen some of your checking in and that it's a lot of work. It is, but it's very valuable to your career success. So activities, again, you would just click on that. And this is where you're going to find more things to read, sample resumes, talking about cover letters. Take time to really investigate these. Then you had to read about Super's lifespan theory. And most of you know my questions were back to you about Super. Write your response. Make sure you're answering everything. What stage of your career development? Da, da, da. And then you have this narrative which asked about networking, education, career skills, and professionalism. And you had to write a 100 to 150 paragraph that explains, or it said for each category above, write a paragraph. Now, some, some didn't do that quite as crisp as it, I would have liked. So that was week two. Now we're into week three. Social learning and theory of career choice. You're looking at Krumholt, social learning theory. You're going to look at ONET. And that gives you a little bit about next week we're going to start looking at elevator pitches. So let's take a look. Okay, again, you're going to listen or watch this, read it. But then activities. You're going to revise the resume, revise your cover letter. You're going to check in. Just let me know what's going on. Do you need help? Everything fine? you got another reflection, another development plan, graphic, graphic literacy, and another assessment. So you got one, two, four, six things here to do on top of the discussion post and engaging. So remember, if, and again, if you don't know what to do or where to find, they're all right here. They're all right here. And your grading rubrics, it's ask, what it's asking you, it's all right in here. You're going to read this article. Anytime I reference an article back to you and say, what did you learn from your reading or from this article or this, it's all back in here in the weeks tab. 
So I hope this helps you stay on task. Again, you've got the tracking calendar. You've got the weeks tab. It's more than just a discussion post. The discussion posts, though, were fabulous. Everybody did a great job on discussion posts. In the places where points were lost was maybe word count or typos, you know, commas, punctuation. That type of thing was really where I saw the, word, the points being lost. So grading's done. Take a look. And everybody have a great weekend. If you need me, you know how to reach me. Bye-bye.